questions just across the road there at, uh, at Belmore. Repositioning Matt Burton. Now, Birdo did some media on Wednesday where he said he's under pressure to keep his spot at 5'8", because obviously they've got Toby Sexton there, Drew Hutchison, geez, Kurt Mann, Bailey Beyond Odo, Jamin Salmon, every other utility they've signed. Um, but did say he wants his hands on the football. Mm. He, he wants to be involved, wants to lead the team around the park as much as he can. And, I mean, he was bought to, you know, if he wanted to play centre, he could have stayed at Canterbury. Uh, stay at Penrith, not on the same money, of yeah. course. But, um, Dave, I did read, I don't want to go too far ahead, but I had you do a little preview that we'll be rolling out at some point. Your best Bulldog 17 had Matt Burton in the centres. Yeah, Mobsy, look, I think... Um, oh, look, I wrote about a couple of weeks ago in, that, in, in my Sunday column about why I think the Bulldogs are currently in a position that they weren't in the past, and that is options in their halves. And and I think Matt Burton's move to 5 8 was a byproduct of, well, one, it, it helped sign him, mm. right? It did, because there was an appetite there. But two, there really wasn't a great depth of halves options at the Dogs last season. And now that they do have... They're not elite. I'll give you that. They are not elite. But I thought Toby Sexton actually did enough in a short space of time at a brand-new club, mid-season switch. That's tough. He's a young fella. And with a big preseason, leave him in the halves. And I thought Drew Hutchison always did a job when he, when he was asked to for the Sydney Roosters. So I would throw them together and just create this elite-level... Back line. It would be enormous. With Crichton and Burt in the centres, on your edges, Kikau and Jacob Preston, and then on your wings, Karaz and Josh Addo Carr, and you could have Blake Taff, and I expect Connor Tracy to eventually get there um, at, at fullback. So that I do, I'm just thinking of the makeup of the back line, and I think yeah. Burton suits in the centres. I think if Tracy lobs there, someone was trying to tell me this week that if Tracy lobs there, as we expect him to do, Taff will play six with Sexton. Ah, uh, yep. And, has, done, and, has done in the past. But that's why... I'd prefer mm. Burton myself. Would I, you? Well, he's... You, know, you pay a guy big bucks, right, to play 5-8. That's what they paid him for. He played in a state of origin game. I understand that, Dave. Centre. He's a better centre than and, a six. And was, and he's he, a better centre than a six. Were, the commentary team were arguing what? whether he was man of the match that day. The, he's the best six they've got, in my opinion. I think he's a better six. I than think he'll be. He's a I better six it, than Hutchison. I think in three years, four years time, he'll be a gun six. He mightn't stay. But the he felt, might get so pip. Why? Because he's on the exact same him money. In the he might <laughs> take a lot. He might go. He won't. Benji might come in as well. If you if you can't <laughs> if you can't devise a, an attacking game plan that mm. gets the ball to Matt Burton that allows him to still put up his torpedo bombs. Mm. At centre, I don't see it as a major It's a very issue. good edge. Him kick out plays left edge, I think, doesn't he? And Josh had a car. You know that play where Birdo loves jamming off his left foot and coming back at the line? I'm not that technical. Ten, like five, five, <laughs> out, like yeah. five metres off the trial. Yeah. Yeah. Like he uses his power and his yeah. speed and his footwork. Put him at centre as if he's not going to beat an opposition centre. Yeah. yeah. I'll tell you what would help them. Go get Tommy Dearden. Shove him at six. Oh, now you're just mm. buying everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. Well, it's the dogs, mate. Well, hang on, just like, See you later, buddy. We've got to buy I've someone else. I've just rattled off six different <laughs> halves options and you want to go and do it, buy another half. Well, the best one. Well, the second best one. You know the, well, game, the, you know the rest of the game aren't convinced on Tom Dearden? No, sorry. Some there aren't. are some sections aren't. of yeah. the game that aren't convinced yes. on Tom Dearden. Yeah, some aren't. I am. I love him. I think he's a very yeah, good player. Yeah, I think footballer. he's a good player. How sad were you when he left Brisbane? Well, I was in, remember I was at, in Seeds We Trust, mate. Seeds <laughs> <laughs> oh, old sympathiser, so baby. Um, but j- just back to Bruce Burton. Bruce picked up all right. They've gone all right. Ezra, yeah, Man, yeah. Ezra Mann's on a bad player. Yeah, yeah. They, they're going to run into some good. trouble. Who? The Bronx. In what sense? They'll lose a couple. They've already lost them. You don't think they'll lose a bit more? I think they'll willingly give up a couple so of They've got to keep Reese Walsh and they've got to keep Ezra Mann and they've got to keep Jordan Ricky. They'll keep Ezra. He's not going anywhere. Okay. Jordan Ricky's not going anywhere. Capewell. He might be squeezed out. Oof, good player. Yeah. But when you've got... Hey, Parramatta could use your Capewell. You've got Ricky and Paikura. Mm. Yeah, good yeah, player too. I'll tell you what, Parramatta could use you Capewell. You give Brad a ring. I will. <laughs> your man. Brad, I'll give you a ring. You've got him on speed, yeah. <laughs> Just get... Uh, just <laughs> got some advice for you, Brad. Stay Ricky over here. I'll take some out. Who? Let's just... Oh, you um, want Papa back? <laughs> you don't need Capewell. The Dragons. Yeah, he's a leader. Yeah. Mate, he's had success at every footy he's club he's been to. He's a winner. Started at the Sharks, yep. part of that premiership team. 
Yep. Penrith, Premiership. He's a winner, Broncos, Dave. Broncos, Grand Final. Flano needs winners. Good he player, is leaders. Mate. Yep. Um, just back to Burton for a second there. Sorry. The, no, no, you're right. The, um, I, I sort of agree task. with you with that. You're talking about that left foot step. <laughs> He's just waving at random people. Oh, what's going that on? That was here? the boss, Tim Morrissey, oh, okay. the Sydney King legend. Right. Um, the issue for Canterbury as well is where you want, because with options now, you, you wanted Burton there for that fifth tackle kick, didn't you? Because yeah. it just mm. up she goes. But um, Sexton's got a good kick now, isn't Yeah, it? But, that, but this also gives him the option to be there on the fourth tackle to do yeah. something. Yeah. You know, yeah. On that, that fourth tackle where you want to put a move on, yeah. when you want to be, you know, you want your best players involved in that play. And if that's the case, if he gets held up with the ball, you need another kick yeah. option. I think they really lacked that last season. I agree, Whereas Mozzie. You look at those list of guys there with decent kicking games that mm. can help give them more options. Which Is he a left or right footer, Berto? Who's that? Lefty. Left. He's left. left. Yeah. When the Sharks won the comp in 16, yes. they would play to their left to Wade Graham. Right. And he would launch that left foot kick and get them out of trouble so many times. Mm. Okay. Right? Because Jimmy Maloney and Chad Townsend were under pressure on the kick. Foot, throw to the left and Wade would punch him downfield. Berto can do the same thing. My issue there is you don't want to be building a side based around which foot a bloke kicks with. In my opinion, there's bigger things to play. Mate, it's not you're not building. It's a, it's an additional. You're not basing your back line around. Oh, oh, you're kidding, mate! It's an additional weapon. It's a yeah, okay. It's still a weapon. You're not si- building. It's still a weapon at six, though. Hey? They're not sitting in the team room with the whiteboard up there going right over. <laughs> We're only foot. playing left. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but he can kick the ball. Might at be six. another Zoolander reference for you. Yeah, only go, only go, only ten minutes, only go left. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I like him at six. I think he's a very right. good player. And you pay him a lot of money, and that's what they brought him to do. So just pick him there, just put him there, and let him have a go. 